welcome back students today i'll continue from where i have left so last time i have taught you how to add video and along with the video how can you record your own voice okay so today we'll be also adding text how we can write and then little animations so first of all i'll add some image and then i'll show you how can we add some effects upon that okay so first of all i'll click upon layer so as i click upon layer you know very well where the layer is uh, this is the layer i'll click upon this and then from the layer you could see here uh, media and from the media okay i'll just select my random clicks and from here uh, like this starting one i am having one uh, image here so i have added one image okay so after adding the image what i'll do i'll just crop it then just to make it little small and then crop it and i hope you know very well where is the crop option uh this is the crop option i'll just click upon this and then i will try to make it small only flower i need oh, this is okay then i'll click on tick okay so now i want to do some animation based upon this so how can i do the animation after clicking upon this i'll increase this then after increasing this image now this is the another layer and this layer is on the top by default the previous one the yesterday the last tutorial what i have done that is on the top by default it is showing on the top but the uh, in kind master whichever layer is coming beyond that layer where it is shown below that comes on the top okay so you could see here you could see here this layer it's uh, at the bottom comparing to the previous layer but uh, when you will render it or when you are seeing it it is coming on the top by default so so i'll just close this now i want to do little animation so for animation what what do you have these uh, three could see three icons this is for animation okay the first one means it allows you to uh, make animation uh, as and uh, giving it as a entrance effect i'll click upon this effect and i want that my flash should come fading in like this you could see here if i click on pop it is something like this you could see slide so many are there you can try yourself so i'll click on my favorite fade then i click on tick after this uh yes be sure that your particular that layer should be selected otherwise if you do the animation and by default your first layer is selected the animation will take effect upon the first layer then the middle one you will select this one and then uh, here i'll select this option many are there so i want the ring one i like this effect a lot okay giving it as a glimpses of 3d so i can select this one and then the last one 
this one the last one so i'll select this one that means how my animation should finish so it could be this way counter clockwise scale down this is okay okay so now if i am running my video as you click on start you will see the video is started and then according to that i can speak like suppose about uh, for red rose and beautiful flowers pink flower then yellow flowers okay oh yes i'll see how it ends so this can be very much beneficial for okay. your recording so i hope it is clear to you how to give simple animation suppose now i want to add some text here okay so how can i do that for that also i need suppose from here i need some text so i click on layer and i'll select here text i can uh, write any text here suppose beautiful beautiful flowers okay i click on okay you could see here separate layer uh, this is shown in yellow color by default so now you can edit this how can you edit it right side you could see here plenty of options are shown so first of all i'll select a color from here you can select a color suppose you are selecting yellow from here also three options are there for selecting the color from here also you can select okay darker lighter many are there many effects are there from here also combination you could do and from here you can uh, make the opacity less so just now this is okay yellow color is okay for me then uh, first option i can select different fonts of course you have to download the fonts so i have already downloaded suppose i am selecting this one robotic black or here you could see many many are there suppose i am selecting this let's see how it looks okay so it's looking something like uh, it's beautiful now yes this i can increase or decrease this text i can increase or decrease you could see the effect here the space in between can be increased then uh, yes outline is beneficial i'll on the outline now you could see beautiful flowers uh, it's coming uh, you know uh, you, you could easily see it earlier yellow color was not visible but by giving the outline you could easily see it i can select the color from here i think this is not looking good i can select some other mm, this is okay or you can go for blue or black click on tick then uh, shadow option is also there if you click on this you can click on shadow and uh, distance you could see here at the bottom and then color what you want for the shadow you can select from here I selected black color so you could see here the black color is visible a little bit uh, just it is a shadow 
distance you can set from here distance of the shadow angle you could just see where it's feasible for you to give the angle okay so we have done this also then uh, so we have used all this yes this can also be beneficial glow if you want to make your text glow so just you could see the effect see it's glowing okay so it's glowing i can change the color i think it will be easier for you to watch the difference so see light green color it's glowing you can select any color whatever you feel okay con start you will see the video is started and then according to that I so my animation is still here only till wherever you feel you can expand your uh, text and then in this text also you can uh, give the animation here also the option is there alpha opacity you could see here you can control the opacity from here see very light like this okay so you can just do that and then uh, so i don't want to trim this you know very well the rest of the options mostly i have told you mirroring uh if you want to mirror it so i don't want to mirror it if you want to rotate okay so it depends upon the situation but for me it is okay and then uh these are the blending overlay i'll show you that also if i click on overlay it's looking something like this multiply screen soft light different different options are there darken color burn okay so i click on normal only for me this is okay so i explained you all the things uh, one thing is left uh, if you want to give background color so you can do from here okay this is for full width background i'll just select some color so just to make you clear just see i've just selected the black color full width so you could see the difference so i'll not enable it I'll click on tick now i'll give the effect for this so while entering effect as last time i've told you i'll click on this one then pop uh, this one is okay and then continuously i want like it could be flickering just you see blink show okay then pulse is also good and i also like floating so it moves here and there like float okay i click on tick and then simply if i want to end my text so it could be like this okay diverge so now if i play this if you click on start you will see the video is started and then according to that i can speak like suppose about uh, for red rose and beautiful flower so i hope all these things are very much clear to you now little animation animations uh, by default you have learned by default animations i want to add my own animation manually so what i could do i can click on layer you could see here overlay overlay i'll select from here so i'll select overlay so i have downloaded the effects for overlay you can also download uh so i'm selecting 
some sparks or something i'll see what it is different different effects are there well this is not looking good for me i'm just selecting something else let's see this one So let wait. I'm seeing some good effects which I could show you. So okay, I've selected one. Uh, let's see. I'll click on tick. This effect is something like this. Okay. So if I'll play it, I'll see how it looks. Pause. Beautiful flowers. Yeah, this is looking good. So I can also increase this effect. And what I can do, I want to move this revolving. This rotation I want to remove, uh, move from one place to another. So how can I do that? I'll select this. Suppose this side. I want it should enter from here so what I'll do you could see here key this key option so I'll select this I'll click on the key okay and then a little bit I'll move here as I move inside you could see a little bit I'll move I'll move here manually I have to do this animation then here then here means you have the manual control upon your animation then here Okay, I click on tick. Let's see how it looks. As you click on start, you will see the video is started. And then according to that, I can speak like suppose about uh, for red rose, and beautiful flowers, pink flower, then yellow flowers. Okay, so this can be very much beneficial for your recordings. If you are making any video, you can record here like yellow i hope it is very much clear to you and then i can add one effect that it should how it should go then uh, the last one what i have told you earlier the animations by default animation i'll select i'll click on fade so i'll check very much once beneficial for your recordings if you are making any video you can record here like yellow flower i hope it is very much clear so my this tutorial has become too lengthy so i'll stop my tutorial here only so just practice this so till then goodbye